Big Z Reviews. Uncut Gems is a drama thriller from the Safdie brothers and that mainly starring Adam Sandler as Howard Ratner. And he is like a jeweler that is uh, has a bad gambling problem. And it's kind of like a series of events where it coincides with uh, the ending of the of ba basketball playoffs and his his uh, his debts coming in, um, and he needs to pay him. But then he's also coming in his his potential uh, big payday when he got this uh, this huge uncut like a uh, special opal from the mines of Africa. And that is also Kevin Gardner, uh, the basketball player, like coming in. There's a, there's a lot of different things that come into this first, and this, like, it's very, it's a very interesting film. You're taking my money all over town, placing bets. I'm having very serious second thoughts. Are you serious right now? I know I fucked up. Howard, where's the money right now? Howard, got my money. Howard. Howard. Is it too late? I'm done. That means nothing. It meant nothing. Please. Give me another shot. So the Safety Brothers previous film, Good Times, I didn't really enjoy that much. It was interesting, but I didn't like. This one I like more, but still has a lot of the flavor of Good Times. Like, they definitely have a tone, the Safety Brothers. Like, really kind of piercing music that like almost like electronic but kind of weird like synth music that really drives everything along and like cr a lot of crazy cut editing and really kind of they're kind of relentless and i mean it's it's really interesting but i think adam sandler is like he was amazing in this film he plays that uh, douchebag really well and like so many times throughout the film he's like just stop just stop now you, you're good or just you know, then he keeps going and going and going and it's it's crazy, and you know, and you like you can't help but like really hate the guy, but at the same time you kind of love the guy because it's so it's like it's enthralling, but it's like you are just it's so frustrated at him at the same time, and it's it's a really well crafted film, and I I did thoroughly enjoy it, like but I think that your enjoyment of the film is going to come down to what you think about from the climactic event of the film there's some they towards the climax a lot of shenanigans occur and ha what you think about them will flavor your whole uh, opinion on the film and for me i didn't love it but i i liked it i like what they did and I, I understand what they did i think that you know that will really decide on what you think about the film but i i did enjoy it it's just i don't, I don't know if i'd ever want to watch it again like if it is, it's like, I think if you watched it, like if you in, in the if you you had a headache brewing, it'd give you a full blown migraine. I think, you know, something about it is very, it, it's very jarring their style, uh, but I'm very interested to see what they do next. It, it's too bad this film really didn't get any recognition from the Oscars, but eh, what you gonna do? I, I probably give it like an eight out of ten. I would recommend it, but not like wholeheartedly. But uh, thanks for watching. You share with the from my head and subscribe to the over there. Thanks. This has been a Big Z movie review. Thanks for watching.